Welcome to Fluid. This is TRX Yoga and my name is Carrie. I'll be taking you through a short flowy flow today. Uh, we're trying to flow like water, able to change our path based on what is in our path, not fight it, but flow with it or flow around it. So you'll notice there'll be a lot of arm movements matching with the breath today. We have a couple different transitions that are a little difficult, um, but stay with your breath and just enjoy the flow. The Spotify playlist is called Water Flow, so if you've got Spotify, you can find that playlist called Water Flow and get it started right now. We'll start with our straps at mid-length or even a little bit shorter, and we'll start standing today facing our anchor with our hands in the foot cradles. So you can get your playlist started. Shorten your straps a little shorter than mid-length. Walk back, put your hands in the foot cradles, palms down, face your anchor, Bring your feet together so your big toes and your heels align and are close or touching. Bring your arms up overhead, your palms turn towards the anchor, and you pull the backs of your hands back on the straps so the straps are taut. Find a range that works for you up overhead. Stay here, reach your fingertips up towards the ceiling, tuck your tailbone down towards the ground, relax your ribcage and create a little tension between your feet, in between your legs, squeeze your glutes, tighten your abs, reach up, inhale. Slowly lower your arms and turn your palms down towards the ground, exhale, stay right here. Lengthen tailbone to the top of your head, press gently into the straps to feel your whole core light up. And start to breathe from the back of your throat feeling and hearing the breath in the back of your throat. Feeling grounded through the feet, lengthen through the top of your head, and flowing with your breath. Feel the wave of your breath in and out from your belly to your rib cage. Hearing it in the back of your throat and feeling it in the back of your throat. We'll take two more breaths here. Inhale fully. Exhale through your nose. Inhale through your nose. Exhale through your nose. Now we'll add the arms. Inhale, reach your arms up overhead. Palms turn towards the anchor. Exhale, slowly lower your arms. Just let them flow with your breath. Inhale, reach up. Maybe look up this time. Exhale, lower your arms. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, lower your arms. Inhale, reach up. Stay right there. And we'll cactus the arms this time. Exhale for just a little back bend. Broaden the chest. Lift your heart up. Look up. Inhale, reach your arms up and fold forward on your exhale. Palms turn down again. Lengthen your spine, press into the straps. Inhale, look slightly forward towards your fingers. Exhale, fold. Inhale, root through your feet, stand up, reach up, bring your thumbs towards each other. Exhale, slowly lower your arms. Inhale, reach up, pull back on the straps. Forward fold, exhale. Inhale, lengthen your spine, halfway lift. Exhale, fold forward. Strong legs, inhale, stand up, reach up. Bring your thumbs towards each other. Exhale, lower your arms. One more like that, inhale, reach up. Exhale, hinge and fold. Stay right here. Inhale, broaden your chest, let your hands slightly split apart for our cow. Exhale, sweep your hands back towards each other, round your upper back for a cat. Inhale, drop your belly, lift your tailbone, cow. Exhale, round your upper spine, tuck your tailbone down slightly, cat. Go through a few more of these just on your own breathing. The arms just kind of flow naturally as you round and lengthen the spine.
Make your way back to a neutral spine, flat back. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold forward. Stand all the way up. Inhale, reach up, look up. Exhale, lower your arms. Inhale, your left arm up. Turn your palm back. Exhale, press into the foot cradle. Reach your left arm up and side bend to the right. So you're pulling back with your left hand, pressing down with your right hand, creating tension in between your arms. And you should feel this nice stretch in your left side. Anchor through your left heel, left hip. Open your heart towards the ceiling or your left armpit. Come back up, reach your left arm up, inhale. Slowly lower your left arm, exhale. Inhale your right arm up, pull back on the strap. Press into the left hand and exhale, side bend to the left. Open your right armpit, maybe even look up. Anchor through your right heel. Take one more breath. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, lower your arms. This time, cross your left foot behind your right. And we'll do a half sun salutation here. It'll feel a little different. Inhale, reach your arms up. Exhale, hinge your hips, fold forward. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, stand all the way up, reach up. Exhale, lower your arms, uncross your left leg. Cross your right leg behind. Inhale, reach your arms up, both arms. Exhale, hinge and fold. Inhale, halfway lift, lengthen. Exhale, fold. So just a little different feeling on our hip. Inhale, stand all the way up, reach your arms up. Exhale, lower your arms, uncross your leg. Inhale, reach your arms up, chair pose. Exhale, hinge and fold forward. Inhale, halfway lift. Stay here, press into the foot cradles. Exhale, step your left foot back into a projected lunge so you're still leaning forward. Inhale, lift your chest. Exhale, squeeze your inner thighs, squeeze your left kneecap up towards your hips. Stay here for three more breaths. Keep your legs strong and root through the ground on both feet. So you feel very strong with both sides of your body and find that balance. Take one more inhale. Step your left foot in, forward fold, exhale. Halfway lift, inhale, stay here. Step your right foot back, projected lunge. So you're still leaning forward. Inhale, lift your chest. And exhale, just give yourself a squeeze in your inner thighs to square your hips to the anchor. Pull your kneecap to your hip and we'll stay here for three more breaths. Full breaths. Even inhale and exhale. One more breath. Inhale, lengthen a little through your spine. Step your left or step your right foot in forward fold. Exhale. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Chair pose. Inhale, sweep your arms up. Sit back. Exhale, stand up. Reach up. Lower your arms. Cross your left foot behind you again. Inhale, both arms up. Exhale, hinge and fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Now we're going to stay here and step your left foot back like you're reaching towards the right corner of a yoga mat. Lift your chest. So you've got a crossing lunge here. Your right foot is towards the left side of your body and your left foot is towards the right side of your body. Squeeze your inner thighs again and try and square your hips to the anchor. Point your kneecap towards the anchor with your right knee. Press into the straps and we'll stay here for two more breaths. 
One more inhale. Exhale. Inhale, get a little taller. Step your left foot in behind your right, forward fold. Exhale. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, stand up, reach both arms up, pull back on the straps. Exhale, slowly lower your arms, uncross your legs. So recenter yourself. Cross your right foot behind the left. Get tall, heels to top of the head. Inhale, reach your arms up. Exhale, hinge and fold forward. Inhale, halfway lift and stay. Soften the left knee, step your right foot back towards the left, lift your chest, squeeze your inner thighs, square your hips to the anchor. Try and keep your left kneecap pointed towards the anchor and squeeze your right kneecap to your hip. Two more breaths. Inhale, lengthen. Step your right foot behind your left and fold. Exhale. So a lot of balance in here too. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, rise up, reach up. Exhale, lower your arms. Uncross your legs. Take your right hand in both foot cradles. Find your end range again with your arm overhead. Just make sure you're in the right position. And then lower your arm. Inhale, reach your left arm up. Exhale, chair pose with the left arm up. Inhale, stand up, reach up. Exhale, side bend to your right. Press down into the foot cradle, reach up and over. Open your left armpit towards the ceiling and see if you can find a little bit more length here through the left side. Anchor through your left heel. Inhale, reach your arm back up, stand up. Chair pose, exhale, sweep your left arm back and twist towards your left, thumb is up. Inhale, stand up, reach up. Exhale, chair pose, twist to your left, thumb goes up. Inhale, stand. Reach, exhale, chair pose, twist. Hold it right there, three breaths. Square your hips to the anchor. Squeeze your legs together. Tear the floor apart between your feet to create tension. One more inhale and exhale. Inhale, stand up, reach up. Warrior two, big step back, exhale. So turn your left toes slightly in and align your heel on your arch, the middle of your arch. We'll take three breaths here. Let your breath flow and let your breath be your guide. One more breath. Inhale, straighten your front leg. Heel toe your left foot in for triangle pose, reach up. Side bend towards the anchor. See if you can wrap your right rib cage under, left rib cage open. And we'll take a few breaths here. Press into your, the ball of your right foot. Squeeze your calf, squeeze your hamstring on that right side so you're not locking your knee. Let's see if you can twist a little bit more open. Inhale, rise. Turn your right foot, pivot your right foot so it's parallel with your left. Now we'll do a warrior two facing away from the anchor. So pivot your left heel in towards you and you'll have to heel toe your right foot back towards the anchor a little bit, whatever is comfortable for you. Right foot slightly rotated in. And do your best to align your heel to your arch. Flip your left palm up, inhale, reverse your warrior. Use the strap to let you pull back to the anchor. Exhale, warrior two, sink a little lower. Stay low, reach up, inhale, reverse. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, warrior two, and we'll hold this for a few breaths. 
strong legs and strong through your arms, fingertips to fingertips. We'll take one more inhale and exhale. Inhale, straighten your left leg. Turn your left toes so they're parallel with the right. Open your arms wide, take an inhale. Hinge for a straddle fold, exhale. Flat back, nice and long like you have airplane wings here. And you're flying, maybe you're hovering over the ocean and you're flying over the ocean. Even weight distribution in your heels and the balls of your feet. Take one more inhale. Exhale. Inhale, rise. Turn your heels in towards each other for a goddess pose. You might need to heel toe your feet in a little bit more. So reach your left arm out. Inhale. Sink your hips down. Exhale, pull your knees back. Stay here. Inhale, reach your left arm up and over to the anchor, side bend. Exhale, straighten your left arm. Inhale, stand up. Exhale, squat down, goddess pose, pull your knees back. Inhale, side bend, reach up and over, get long through your left side. Exhale, straighten your arm, come back to center. Inhale, stand up. Exhale, squat down. Inhale, side bend, reach up and over. Breathe into your left rib cage. Exhale, come back to neutral. Lower your arm. Inhale, stand up. Exhale, goddess pose. Three breaths here, stay right here. Pull your knees back, broaden your chest, sink a little lower. One more inhale. And exhale. Inhale, straighten your legs. Exhale to triangle. So you'll have to turn your left toes in. Maybe heel toe your left foot back a little. Right toes face the anchor. Reach up, get long. Side bend to the right. And then see if you can push your hips back a little bit once you've done your side bend. And twist the right rib cage under left rib cage back. We have one more breath here. Inhale, rise. Pivot your back foot so you face the anchor. Take both hands in the foot cradles. We'll be a little closer than where we began. Step forward, forward fold. Just hold it right here. We'll go into a little cat and count. If you need to shift your position so you're centered on the anchor, go ahead. Broaden your chest, tilt your tailbone up. And then tuck your tailbone around your upper back. So as you broaden your chest and expand, inhale. Exhale, round. On your own breath. One more. Find neutral, halfway lift, inhale, exhale, fold. Just stand up, leave your arms low this time, inhale. And we'll reset our positioning. So you'll bring your arms back up overhead to find an end range, pull back on the foot cradles. Bring your feet together, lower your arms. This time your left hand goes in the foot cradles. Inhale, your right arm up, reach up. Exhale, chair pose. Sit back with your, with your hips. Inhale, reach up, stand up. Exhale, side bend to your left, reach up and over. Root down through your right heel. Open your right armpit. Keep a little tension in the strap on your left hand. And maybe you look up here. One more breath, inhale, and exhale. 
Inhale, stand up, reach your right arm straight up. Chair pose, sweep, sweep your right arm back. Exhale, twist to your right. Try not to let your hips go with you. Inhale, stand up so your hips stay square. Exhale, hinge your hips straight back. Sweep your right arm back, thumb goes up on your exhale. Inhale, rise, reach up. Exhale, twist. Hold this, three breaths. Square that left hip, so pull your left hip back. Two more breaths. One more breath. Rise up, reach up, inhale. Step back with your right foot, warrior two. Nice big step back. So align your heel to your arch. Get strong here. We'll take a few breaths here. Make sure that your left knee is pulling out and not caving in. And can you grow a little taller and sink a little lower? Straighten your left leg on an inhale. Heel toe your back foot in, triangle pose. Exhale, side bend towards the anchor. Reach up, relax your left shoulder. And after your side bend, see if you can push your hips back away from the anchor a little. Twist left rib cage under, right rib cage open. Strong legs as you rise, inhale. And we'll turn our feet so your left foot pivots and is parallel with your right. Now, as you pivot your feet, we'll go into a warrior two facing away from the anchor. We'll pivot your right heel in towards you. So your toes face away and you might have to heel toe your left foot back towards the anchor. Warrior two. Look out over your right fingertips. Take one more breath. And then we'll flow. Turn your right palm up. Inhale to reverse. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, warrior two. We'll take a couple breaths here. Keep trying to pull your right knee outwardly towards your right so you can see your right big toe. Let's take one more breath. Straighten your right leg. Turn your right toes so they're parallel with the left. Back into your wide hinge here. Arms out, inhale. Hinge your hips, exhale, and you're flying over the ocean. Use that broadening of your chest, broadening of your wingspan to bring a little expansion in your body and in your breath, even in this folded position where it's difficult to take an inhale. Breathe into your back, one more breath. On an inhale, rise up. And we'll go into our goddess pose. So you'll have to turn your heels in and you may need to heel toe in a couple steps. Take your right arm out. Inhale, exhale, squat down, goddess pose. Inhale, reach up and over to the anchor. Exhale, back to goddess pose, arm out. Inhale, stand up. Exhale, squat down, pull your knees back. Can you sink a little lower? Inhale, reach your palm up and over to the left. Exhale, straighten your arm, come back to center. Inhale, stand. One more. Exhale, lower. Inhale, reach up. Breathe into the right rib cage. Exhale, goddess pose. We'll stay here for three breaths. Stay right here. Keep pulling your knees back. Stay on the outer edge of your feet. Also feeling grounded through your big toe, little toe and heel. One more inhale. And exhale, inhale, rise, Woo. triangle pose, exhale. So turn your right foot in. You might have to heel toe back a little bit. 
Turn your left toes so they face the anchor. Reach your right arm up. Take a breath. Side bend. Feel that length in the right side and then push your right hips back. And see if you can open a little bit more towards the ceiling and relax your left shoulder. We have one more breath here. Rise up. Pivot your right foot to face the anchor for a crescent lunge. Take both hands in the foot cradles. It'll be a little off center here, that's okay. Press in the straps to find some tension in your body. Step your right foot in, forward fold. Now, if you wanna scoot back towards the center a little bit, if you're off center like I was, go ahead. And we'll just stay in this fold and breathe. Relax your head. Bend your knees a little so your belly goes towards your thighs. Keep your belly towards your thighs as you work to straighten your legs. Keep your hips nice and high. Halfway lift. Inhale. Exhale, fold. Leave your arms low. Slowly roll up from the base of your spine. Head is last. going to go down on the ground, which means your straps need to lengthen to mid-calf. So take your straps, pull them down so the handle is just below your kneecap, and take the straps into a single handle. And if you don't know how to do a single handle, then just stack your foot cradles and put your left foot in both foot cradles. We'll face away from the anchor, lining your left side up on the anchor. Put your left foot in the strap. Flex your left ankle and press down firmly into the strap so your ankle is in a nice closed and stable position. Place your hands down like you're in a tabletop position. Step your right foot through in between your hands. Inhale, lift your chest. Stay on an exhale and just let your hips settle. Square your hips away from the anchor and pull your right hip back. Inhale, reach your arms up. Stay here and breathe. Just invite a little length in your left hip. Inhale, lengthen, reach up. Exhale, hinge your hips back. Hamstring stretch. Let's find some length. Inhale, lengthen tailbone to crown of the head. Hold that length and then exhale if you want to fold in, you can. Stay here and breathe. Little sips of air. It's tough to get breaths. It's tough, tough to get big inhales when you are in a folded position. Inhale, lengthen your spine, reach the top of your head forward. Bend your right knee, exhale. Plant your hands on the outside of your foot. So now we're a little further away from the anchor. Inhale, exhale, twist. You leave your left knee down. Just stay on one inhale. Exhale, lower your right hand down to the inside of your right foot. Stay here for a breath. Now exhale, twist away. Left arm goes up. Hug your right knee to your right shoulder. Stay on one inhale. Exhale, lower your arm. Reframe your foot. Inhale, straighten your left leg now. Push your heel back. Exhale, twist to your right. Inhale, reach your right arm forward. Exhale, lower your right arm and twist, reach back. Inhale, reach your right arm up and forward. Exhale, lower your right arm 
and twist back. Inhale, reach up and forward. Exhale, lower, twist back. Inhale, reach your right arm straight up. Exhale, lower your right arm, lower your left knee. Step your right foot back, child's pose. You can slip your left foot out, hinge your hips back. Breathe into your back. Take two more breaths here. Walk your hands back underneath your shoulders. Press yourself back up. And then move over to your left. So your right hip is aligned with the anchor. Put your right foot in the foot cradle. Plant your hands down in a tabletop position. Step your left foot through in between your hands. Anchor through your left leg. Press down into the ground and inhale. Uh, lift your chest up. Square your hips, so pull your left hip back towards the anchor. Reach your arms up overhead and breathe. Now if your arms have had enough overhead work and we've done a lot today, then feel free to take your hands in a prayer position or even just rest them on your thigh. And just invite a little more length here in that right hip. Lift up out of the front rim of the pelvis in the top. So try and create a little bit more length in the whole front of your body from your right knee up through your fingers. Take one more inhale, reach up. Exhale, plant your hands down, frame your foot. Inhale. Exhale, twist to your left. Keep your knee down. Just stay on one. Inhale. Exhale, lower your left arm to the inside of your left foot. Anchor your knee to your shoulder. Inhale. Exhale, twist away. Keep pulling the knee into the shoulder. One inhale. Exhale, plant your hand, reframe your foot. Inhale, straighten your right leg. Exhale, twist to your left. Inhale, reach your left arm forward. Exhale, lower your left fingertips down to the ground and twist, reach back towards your back foot. Inhale, reach up and forward. Exhale, lower your arm and twist. One more. Inhale, up and forward. Exhale, down and twist. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, lower your left arm. Lower your right knee. Step your left foot back. Un uh, or take your right foot out of the foot cradles and push your hips back in a child's pose. This time you're going to tuck your um, knuckles down towards the ground, your, your palms are up, and take your forehead down. And just relax your shoulders, relax your upper back, and just let your body give in to gravity. It's not easy to breathe in these folded positions, so just invite little sips of air here. Take one more breath. Bring your hands underneath your shoulders. Press yourself up. And we'll stand up and finish in a supported wheel pose or standing wheel pose. So if your straps are in a single handle, leave them there. 
and we'll take the straps around our back like a jacket. The straps go right underneath your shoulder blades and pull up to give us traction on our spine. So make sure that they're right underneath your shoulder blades. Feel them pull. Step in towards your anchor to load it. Slide your arms up the straps. Inhale, reach your right arm up. Exhale, open your right arm. Follow your right hand with your head. Inhale, reach your right arm up. Side bend to your left. Exhale. Breathe into your right rib cage. Open your right armpit and look up. Inhale, come all the way back up, reach up. And then place your hand back on the strap. Take your left arm up, inhale. Exhale, twist to your left, open. Relax your shoulders. If it feels okay, follow your hand with your head. Inhale your left arm up. Exhale, side bend to your right. Now keep pressing your hip points slightly forward towards the anchor. So we're still inviting some length in the front of our body here. And try and breathe into your left rib cage. Inhale, reach up. Lower your left arm. You can either stay here and hold the straps and expand through your chest and go into a little back bend. Or you can let go with both arms if you feel comfortable. And do this nice supported standing variation of a wheel pose. Or you can take it further if you're not on a door anchor. Step forward and get a supported back bend. You'll slide the foot cradles down into your lower back. And just stay here in this position today as long as you feel comfortable. Squeeze the inner thighs together. Plant the hands down under the shoulders. Squeeze your inner arms together. And then if you want, you can press up into a wheel pose, or you can find the straps with your lower back and let the straps do all the work for you today. And when you're ready, if you're in that full wheel pose, bend your elbows, find the straps with your lower back, and then reach for the straps with your hands Pull yourself back up. And we'll sit here and finish in some traction today. So if you were standing in your wheel pose and you have a door anchor, you'll walk yourself in and sit down in a nice deep sumo squat with your back towards your door. If you're not on a door anchor, it doesn't matter which way you face. And just let the straps support you here. They'll pull up on your um, low back and you should feel some length all the way up your spine and if the straps start to creep up into your armpits you might need to adjust them a little lower this should not be uncomfortable and do your best just to focus on your breath here and if you prefer to finish in a traditional shavasana now would be the time to just ease your way down to the floor and stay here as long as you have time to indulge in this little amount of self-care. Thank you for joining me. Just allow your breath to flow just like water and let that be your guide to either flow around things or through them or with them. Enjoy your day. Namaste.